Oh yeah. It took All me a right. Second. And can you tell us your name? Lydia yeah. or Isolda. Okay. From Skyrim. Yeah. But my real name is Lydia, and there is Lydia in Skyrim. I did her once, <laughs> but now I'm Isolda. All right. And where are you from? Um, well, I'm from Atlanta, but I just moved to California. Oh, awesome. But I'm here. That's a that's a that's a big move. Yeah. Okay. And can you tell us a little bit about your costume and why you chose it? Um, I am Isolda, everyone's favorite NPC to marry. Mm -hmm. um, she really likes that mammoth stuff. I don't know. <laughs> uh, like, it was fun because I wanted to do something um, like like commoner clothing, mm -hmm. and this is my favorite one because of the the leather corset is just so cool looking. And um, I I uh, I mean the, the actual like outfit is fairly simple, but the fun part of it mm -hmm. is doing like the weathering. Because I like, I like the bottom of it. Mm -hmm. Here, let me get this. This is all paint that's been watered down. Mm -hmm. And you can wash it and it won't come off. Oh, so nice. it's awesome. And all the like stitching. Oh wow, you did all the stitching. Yeah. So that's what was so fun about this costume. And like I did the paint on the corset. Oh um, wow. What is that corset leather? What's that made out of? It's a faux leather. I found it on accident in like a bargain bin. Uh -huh. And it just has that like rough looking. But oh, nice. I'm too afraid to weather real leather. Oh yeah, that yeah. makes me nervous. And it's just too. like a lace up bag. Oh, wonderful! Wow, that looks beautiful. And I, um, because it's so hot here, I, I cheated. Like this layer ends like right here, and like this is just fake, you know? Because she's like wearing a whole second dress under it. But like, well, it's in so Skyrim. Hot. They get cold, and Atlanta yeah. is not. Cool. And I try to use like natural looking materials. And it looks great. I love the different textures. Like I don't know if you can see in and the I video. Found, I found snowberries. Oh, see my snowberries? They're beautiful. And my flowers. Did you find them like that or did you make yeah, those? Yeah, I found them. And I have a butterfly somewhere. Yeah, there's my butterfly that I so cruelly awesome. caught out of the air. Beautiful. Like, you know if you catch them in Skyrim you rip their wings off? Yeah, exactly. That seems so mean. But you can kind of see the texture she shows. She uh, chose has little like this was actually on it. I picked it because the actual material looked natural and it was the only color in the store. Uh, it was Joanne's, the only color I could find that matched. Um, they didn't have like a solid linen, so I was like, well, whatever. I mean, it still looks okay. Um, it looks great. Because in the game, it's like solid, but I think it still looks okay. So. Nice. Well, what part of the costume would you say you're most proud of? I think the weathering. The weather? Because I don't ever weather and it was just really fun because it's like super dirty. Yeah, it looks, it looks and lived these, in. The shoes are obviously not the shoes she wears but they're like so comfy and they're naturally weathered because I've had them like four years. Oh, perfect. Even better. <laughs> Something comfortable and, and good looking. This wig was my yellow wig and I just like chopped it off. Oh, is that a lace front? Yeah, you can kind of see. It looks great. Wow. Fantastic and job. I made myself dirty. Oh, you took really a simple fun. costume and you've done it very well. Thank you. Awesome job. So, how did you get into the Elder Scrolls games? Uh, my fiance introduced me to Oblivion when it came out in, was it like 2009? No. No, it was like 2006 or something. I don't know. It was old. And I started, he's like, he was playing it. I'm like, I want to try this. So I started playing it. I ended up playing the whole thing, like all the way through all the quests. And he hadn't even like finished it. And then he's like, well, there's this game called Morrowind. So I was like, play, 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 play. Put in hundreds of hours. Um, so obviously when Skyrim came out, I was like a fangirl by then. So of course I put in like at least 500 hours into Skyrim. And, and then, El, you know, ESO came out. I had to play it even though I hate MMOs. What do you think so, of ESO? I I think as for the Elder Scrolls universe, it's awesome. Like they really did a good job keeping the lore, especially even little things. Like if you go into Morrowind, they have war, and there's a war named Rolly, and there's a Rolly from the original Morrowind game, and I was like, oh, it's so cute. So like the areas, the people, the clothes, it's all really good. Um, I'm not an MMO person, so I hate that there are people running around. Mm -hmm. That that kind of brings me out of the world a little bit. And I also don't play with other people, so I couldn't get very far on my own. Um, but what I did play was fun. I mean, I'm not an MMO person. So someone who plays WoW all the time probably has a 
different opinion of that game than me, but I like the, the Elder Scrolls Nest of it. I, I enjoyed too. What faction did you play for, or do you play for? I played all three at some point. Like, I just kind of switched around. Um, I, they're all kind of the same. Like, the main quest is the same on all of them, and mm -hmm. I thought that was kind of like a drawback a little bit because I repeated it over and over. Mm -hmm. But um, I like each world, and all the quests are just really interesting. Um, I don't really have a favorite faction. Okay. But, um, well, what about Elder Scrolls games? Which one would you say is your favorite? You're gonna win this, right? Uh, definitely Skyrim mm -hmm. because. Um, the environment, I think, appeals to me. I'm a very environmental person. Like when it looks realistic and beautiful, mm -hmm. and I and I can imagine myself there. That's like what gets me. Um, Morrowind's my second favorite because it's so huge. I think it's. I want to say still the biggest one, other than ESO. Just like the amount of land that you can like go around and like things you can do. There's a lot more quests and like faction lines that you can do. So like that game is takes forever to get through. And I love like the mushrooms and like the fantasiness. And like I love Oblivion, but Oblivion at the same time was so generic fantasy that I just didn't have that extra like spark to it, but it was still, it was my first one, mm -hmm. so I still love it to death because it was my first one, even though the potato face people were, were really weird. You know, <laughs> I am, I find those potato faces so charming, but <laughs> I know a lot of people disagree with me. So, okay, so what would you say is your favorite or most memorable Elder Scrolls moment? <laughs> my, my favorite, like... Although I did say my favorite game was Skyrim, my favorite thing Elder Scrolls ever is the Shivering Isles because of Shagora. I freaking love his outfit. So like everything related to Shivering Isles, like that whole quest line was just so unique and interesting compared to the other games. So like, I don't know if I have a favorite like moment from it, but mm -hmm. like that that DLC expansion, like that whole moment of the expansion is like my favorite thing ever. Um, like that, I don't know. It's just so amazing because it has that Morrowind environment and Chirograph is fabulous. He's got quite a personality, and, and the, the Shivering Isles are very alien and beautiful. Yeah, and very it's by far my favorite quest line ever. Any Elder Scrolls anything is my favorite. Well, um, thank you. I'm not sure if I have like a moment that's my favorite. I think killing dragons is really awesome in Skyrim. Every time I have a big dragon battle, it's like super awesome. So maybe like the Alduin fight at the end is one of my favorite things. Because um, I just really love killing dragons. Um, awesome. Well, thanks for <laughs> talking to us. Where can we find you on the internet again? Um, my cosplay page is Liddy Design Costumes. Mm -hmm. Um, I, I'm pretty much like, I mean, I have like Twitter and stuff, but I don't really post there much. So, Facebook page is okay. the best place to look at my stuff. Awesome. I'm just going to do another one once over of your costume, your beautiful Isolde costume. Most eligible bachelorette in Skyrim. <laughs> I'm waiting for my mammoth test. <laughs> Uh, thank you. And I love Kashi. I love <laughs> Are they your favorite race? Um, or just uh, the characters? Probably. I mean, I love cats. Like, I'm a crazy cat lady in real life. Uh -huh. So, I love cats. And I've made Kashi characters all for my cats. Like, inspired by my cats. So. Awesome. Well, thanks yeah. for talking with us. All right. Thank you. <laughs>